If you've ever been bit by a fire ant, you know that it sucks. But there is a new weapon against fire ants, and that is an even worse ant. The tawny crazy ant, which I've told you before, uh, has been known to eat people's electronics and be a general menace in places in the south, including Texas and Florida. But it seems when you combine the two, something unexpected happens. So basically, uh, the tawny crazy ants produce their own formic acid that neutralizes the ant venom together into making an ionic liquid. Ionic liquids have never been made before or never been seen to be made before in nature. It's essentially salt in liquid form and it's used for a lot of things such as sealants, solvents, uh, it has the ability to conduct electricity so it also has electric battery applications and this is the first time we've seen animals create this in an organic way. Which is cool. It makes me wonder if I secrete anything special no. that hasn't been seen no. in nature before. And maybe you could bottle you, it. No. Yeah. So they create these molten salts, um, which you would be able to make yourself with table salt if you heated them up to several thousand degrees Fahrenheit, for example. Uh, but they make it their own selves in their bodies, and it's very puzzling, to say the least. And exactly what was said in the German Applied Chemistry uh, Science Journal, and it's it's interesting to see this biological function. I don't think it's it, it's it's surprising or interesting at all because <laughs> it's an interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, no. I, I did. I didn't. Meant, I meant that word wrong. But I mean, it's mutants. It's obvious. Mutants? These ants have now mutated. Do you think this like, is all like a PR campaign for Ant Man? <laughs> Marvel's playing the long game. Wow, this is good. Wow, they, 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 they engineered ants yeah, decades ago. Yeah, yeah they conquered them. the soundtrack. You know, iTunes. Now they're going to conquer nature with their promotions. So that's, that's pretty good. Wow. Or we're just learning a lot more about the biological uh, abilities of these ants, and maybe we can apply them in ways that are helpful to us who are getting bitten by fire ants all the time and it hurts so much. Let me know what you think about the fire ants and the crazy ants combining together two awful things to make something very interesting and possibly helpful to humans. Below in the comments, and please be sure to subscribe.